Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying two Trader Joe's ice creams. I have the Dulce de Leche. And I have the Coffee Bean Blast. These are two different sizes, so they were definitely two different prices. Mine is a full pint. It's 16 ounces, one pint. It was Dulce, $3.79. I wanna make sure, $3.79. <laughs> Kevin's a quart. is a quart, and it was $4.49. Still pretty daggone cheap. So, uh, yeah, yeah, I think that's good. So, we're going to try mine first. Dulce de Leche ice cream, caramel flavored ice cream nice. with a smooth milk caramel swirl. Rich, creamy, and captivatingly caramely, every satisfying spoonful of this ice cream evokes the essence of classic, delectable Dulce de Leches. Uh, <laughs> Their writing's hilarious. I know. You just have to laugh. I, I, yeah. <laughs> it's like they have a thesaurus next to them. Uh -huh. They write these up. <laughs> yeah. Uh, see, it's three servings. Two thirds cup, 123 grams is 300 calories, or it's 910 calories for the whole uh, pint. Okay. And it's pretty soft. So this one. Now and you just you literally just got. I it. just took out the refrigerator. So I. Refrigerator. Uh, the freezer. Yeah, not the refrigerator. Um, this one, I didn't lay out at all because I squished it and it felt uh, squishy. Um, it felt very soft. Uh, the coffee, I actually did lay out for about 10 minutes because it felt much firmer. It's a nice uh, creamy feeling ice cream. It's firm. It's not mushy. I do have to say, it didn't, it didn't have much smell. I always like to smell things before I eat them. Not on a regular basis, like just for these reviews. I don't know why. That is a nice, like, burnt caramel kind of flavor. I think it's delicious. Mm -hmm. it's um, very good. I love the texture. It's very, 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 very smooth. Uh, it, to me, is, um, it's very creamy. Mm hmm it's 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 sweet it's almost as thick as a custard mm -hmm. you know cooked like ice cream mm -hmm. um, it's almost like that it's almost that thick i know they didn't mention salt but i swear it seems like it has salt a good amount of salt in it it's good i can eat that you know yes i could like eat eat and eat just keep eating this yes you keep I, watching we'll keep eating yeah <laughs> yeah i could definitely eat that entire container in one go mm -hmm. It's absolutely delicious. You, that's the bad part is you're not going to want to stop eating it. Now, there is no like like add-ins. Like there's no, nothing. There's to, no toffee bits or peanuts. Or no, there's whatever. nothing to break it up. So it's just all creamy. I, I love uh, chunks and hunks and all that. But I really love it that you just get to appreciate the creaminess of this. Mm -hmm. The only thing is there's nothing holding you back and keeping you... Like, I'm gonna slow you down. <laughs> no, there's no chewing involved. So yeah, there's nothing. Just let to, it melt on your tongue. Yeah, there's nothing to down. slow you down. So that's why you're gonna go through that quickly. But that's one of those I think you'll buy again and again. Yeah, it's very rich. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love that. Very nice. Okay. That's probably one of my favorite Trader Joe's ice creams. Honestly. It's it really is uh, very nice. So this is the Coffee Bean Blast Super Premium Ice Cream. It, uh, like Kevin said, it is a quart. It says a two thirds cup is 320 calories. It is six servings for um, this container. Okay, good. It is sealed. Yeah, that's not really that bad though. What? Like 1800 calories, that whole thing. It's over 18, but somewhere close to that. Do very quick math. Yeah, I don't like doing math on these videos. It almost looks like uh, it has... It's 2000 something. Yeah, I don't like doing math. Uh, it it almost looks like it has kind of a little bit of a freezer burn over the top. Uh, like so 2200? Is that right? I think it's 2200. It looks like little bits it's of... It's ice crystals is what it looks like today. Oh, uh, yes. The, I wouldn't... I would go under that. You think so? Yeah. No, Who kinda... wants to eat ice crystals? No, no, no. I kind of like that sometimes. Like those little, um, um, the fudge pops that you get at Walmart and Kroger, they have always have ice on it. Does it have like a little coffee beans in it? <laughs> I 
That is so strong, you're gonna hate it. Kevin is going to hate that. <laughs> yeah, these are just like little, it's like frozen at the top. Mm-hmm. It's just, just ice. I just know you hate that. That's <laughs> disgusting. <laughs> I knew. Ugh. I knew he would hate that. I mean, you know about some strong, strong black coffee. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. and that it's it is sweet it is mm -hmm. somewhat sweet but boy, yeah. it is bitter it, it's yes. one of the most bitter coffees I've ever had yeah that's more bitter than a straight Starbucks that's how bitter it is hmm wonder why Starbucks ain't come out with ice cream wonder why they haven't put their name on ice cream you know if they could put the name Starbucks on that <laughs> that would be a Starbucks on that would be Starbucks because it is really really strong it's very dark this is for those people who really like um, black coffee yeah you or if like, you like like munching on those espresso beans uh, or coffee beans all the time yes that, yes that's the kind of flavor it has because it is super super strong mm -hmm. it's not I'm, I said it was disgusting it's really not they did a good job for what it is but mm -hmm. but it is just too strong for me personally. It, it really tastes like they they you know there's a lot of ice creams that say coffee, and they do they do taste like coffee. But if I had those ice creams, like Walmart has one right now, that Better Goods brand, it's really nice. But if you took that ice cream next to this one. This tastes like more authentic coffee, mm -hmm. whereas that one's like a sugared creamer coffee. Right. This Trader Joe's is more like you're getting, it's like they turned the pot, the Mr. Coffee coffee pot, you know, they literally took that and made it into ice cream. Mm -hmm. That This tastes more authentic coffee. I, I tell you one thing, it's not. It doesn't taste like that scalded, been there all day, old coffee. No, it, 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 it actually just tastes like strong black coffee. It tastes like strong black coffee. We've had plenty coffee. of coffee ice cream, though, that we've said, you know, you've said before, it tastes like hospital coffee that sits there all day. Yeah. It's really gotten... No, like, it's you know, nice coffee. It, it's not like that. Um, I don't... Doesn't Trader Joe's have their own coffee? And we've, I, well, think I don't so. think we've ever We tried don't buy it because it's a mostly loose coffee. Yeah, I don't think they do the cake. They I do. Don't know if they, I think do they, they do, do cake Maybe, now? I don't know. But we would not be interested in trying that because... We've looked at them a few times, but it's like you have to use the little converter cup thing. Oh, and, I don't want to do that. Yeah, you have yeah. to fill the little cup up. and. If it's not in a K-cap, number one, I'm not interested. I want a K-cap. But no. number two, if even if they do have K-caps, I don't want to buy a whole box because I like flavored coffee. Yeah, and I yeah. know you're probably not going to probably drink be too it strong all, for me. And it's going to be left, you know, so we're just going to give it away. That's why, because I'm pretty sure we've looked at their coffee before. Yeah, I think we have. Um, so this, if you're a black coffee drinker, yeah, I think you will really, I like it. I mean, I could keep eating it, definitely. It doesn't bother me at all, but it is very strong. This is the one to get, though. Yes. If you have <laughs> sweet, delicious. Uh, I mean, the, if you like caramel at all. Yeah, it's absolutely wonderful. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching.